Pabst is for sale, and residents of Milwaukee are trying to bring the beer-making company back to the city where it started. Here's more from the Associated Press. Remnants of Pabst Brewing are everywhere in Milwaukee. The Pabst Mansion, the Pabst Theater, and the now partially renovated brewery complex. Milwaukee made this beer what it is. You know, when you look at the can, it's right on the can. The beer, known mostly for its blue ribbon can, started in Milwaukee by Frederick Pabst in 1844, but its headquarters moved years ago. You know, when I think about Pabst being anywhere else but Milwaukee, it just doesn't make sense. But Susie Settlement and others here want to bring Pabst home. After hearing reports, the company was for sale. She helped start a petition asking Los Angeles owner Dean Metropolis to give Milwaukee first right of sale. So far, they have about 1,300 signatures. Milwaukee's Department of City Development says Pabst is more than welcome to return to Milwaukee. We, we have not seen the details of the plan, so uh, we look forward to discussing that with uh, people who are proposing it. There's no word on an asking price, but it would likely be in the hundreds of millions, if not more. Settlement says they were exploring different crowdfunding ideas to come up with the money. Jim Hurdle bought the company's administrative building and bar and says he doesn't think they'd have a problem raising the cash. We get about a thousand people a week on our tours, and they come from all over the Midwest, all over the country, all over the world. And they've seen this, and when they hear about this, they're going to say, I want to buy a share of stock. This isn't about beer for us. You know, this isn't about creating another opportunity in Milwaukee for people to drink a local beer. We have lots of really good local beer here. This is about investing in the city of Milwaukee. So far, Pabst has no comment on the effort, but the group plans to officially send the letter next week. Carrie Antelfinger, Associated Press.